Hi everybody! I'm going to show you how to copy your view filters in Revit with just a few clicks. This tool is for my EF Tools extension and it's absolutely for free and open source. Let me show you how it works. I'm sure you will love it. Here's my Revit project with multiple floor plans open. And right here in the bottom left corner, I have a source view. And it has random filters applied with graphic overrides. There are filters A, B, C, and so on. Right here on the top, I have three regular views, view A, B, and C. And here on the bottom, I have two views with the same view template applied to them. It's called view template D, E. So the goal is to copy these filters with graphic settings to all these views and view templates. Let's go to EF Tools tab. Then in view templates pull down menu, there is view filter, copy to another view. Click on that. It will open up this menu and we need to select our source view. We can filter between views and view templates if you want. And you can see right here that there are additional prefixes to show you view type. Right here I have some 3D views, then ceilings, elevations, floor plans, and so on. I will use this filter on the top to find my source view. And once you click on it, it will display all the filters applied to it. You can decide which one you want to copy. In my case, I'm gonna click on select all. And now we can click on select destination views. Same as before, we need to select all views and view templates to where we want to copy these selected filters. So firstly, I'm gonna look for my regular views, view A, B and C. And as I have mentioned earlier, view D and E have a view filter applied to them. So we need to look for view template D and E. And lastly, click on the button to copy your view filters. And you can see that everything got more colorful. So we copied our filter successfully. Also, I have a bonus for you. Let's say we want to create a legend for our view filters. To do that, let's go again to EF Tools, in View Filters pull down menu, there is another tool, View Filters, Create Legend. So, firstly, look for a source view or source view template that has some filters applied to it. Then there are some optional settings if you want to change how it looks. I will just keep it default and click on Create Legends. And it will create a legend with a good overview of your filters. I will delete everything that I don't need except for the surface graphics and filter name. And there you have it, we have copied view filters and created view filter legends in just a few clicks thanks to EF Tools. Thank you for watching. If EF Tools is saving you time in your daily work, consider supporting it like my current supporters which you can see right here. And don't forget to like this video. My name is Eric Fritz, I'll see you in the next video.